because there, there's things I, I I filter about like like I don't care I'm not gonna I don't care and, and like not listen to it which is and then there's other things uh that people say uh, I think it hurt it I think it hurts more when I hear hear I'd say criticism within the company mm-hmm. and everyone everyone criticizes their job you know yeah and so and so and not every, but it's not like everyone has to manage it. You know what I mean? What but for me was, huh? yeah, what was what was said to you and why did that hurt you? I think what hurt me about it with this particular criticism I, is I feel like it's the opposite of what how we've been executing. Yeah. Mm. So which for me was a trigger because I mean I've shared with both of you guys like the like the things that trigger me is like when people question like your authority work ethic or the yeah, things yeah. that it's done and all that without having any kind of backup yeah without exactly. anything yeah or without it's any, like, any evidence you don't like it. this so what should we do yeah and what's then what's your or, solution or like that and what's also your counter like, offer <laughs> not even or like what's your counter offer but also what did you experience during this time that's making you say this and like and and then like also take into account other people's experience of it as well yeah because it's only one perspective yeah yeah it's only the one one person and like that doesn't tell exactly how the situation or even how everything was running because only one perspective yeah it it was like that's definitely true like we're definitely one person's perspective of what they're experiencing so i guess that's like the thing that that there's this like chip on my shoulder of like i don't know i don't know why i have this want to show otherwise Mm. The want to prove them wrong. Yeah. yeah. It could be just maybe just being unnecessarily competitive about it. It could just be it could be also like like I know that like that's probably that's probably a fear too. Like what if what if they're right? Yeah. And so I need to prove them wrong mm-hmm. because yeah. this is because X, Y, and Z is happening. Yeah. 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 So because again, it's all it, it again from my my perspective it's their perspective, but it's also my perspective. It seems like, oh, it seems like everything is running fine. So it was like, yeah, their perspective and what was said reflecting that perspective was basically saying that what you and like how you intended to run the company isn't happening. Yeah. Sorry, what was that? Yeah. No, no, no. um, Like that, that person's perspective plus what was said to reflect that was basically saying that um, what was what's currently happening in the company was not how you intended to run it and yeah. how you're intending to currently run it. Yeah. Yeah. Essentially right. they're saying you're telling us this, but we don't but, see it. Yeah, exactly. Or I don't see lying. it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. But mm. I don't see it. <laughs> what happened? What's happening? No, 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 Let's no. Go. Because that is that's the common theme mm-hmm. in yeah. this situ- in this this theme of of of, of what's been happening. Yeah. In, you know, with these people <laughs> yeah like, yeah like i don't see it mm-hmm. i don't yeah. know it's like just because you yeah. guys don't see it doesn't mean that it's it's not happening it's yeah. happening it's but happening you're not, it's but you're not acknowledging it as the fact that it's happening. it's it's weird it it's like you can give someone a situation and they will say like mm-hmm. this one thing can happen like yeah. and then people will sit people will say two different things about it. Yeah. yeah. And and I think that what I guess hurt me about it and was that it's the the company and the way we run rehearsals and we do everything was optimized based off all of our collective experiences, the ones who've been dancing for yeah. the longest time. Yeah. And then uh, we know what we don't like in terms of long long rehearsals, knowing mm-hmm. we need like we need yeah. proper breaks bringing recovery items to make sure you yeah, yeah. Well, like, even then like, like you, having a game plan yeah yeah having long rehearsals but the amount of things that are getting done during rehearsals mm-hmm. does not compare to anything ever what i've ever experienced yeah because 
in previous teams, we've taken we've taken months to put together a five minute set. And then <laughs> we've taken five hours here to put together a five minute set. Yeah. yeah so it's very much like the optimization mm-hmm. for like unless I feel like unless they've gone through the ringer we have, mm-hmm. they won't appreciate it. Exactly. You yeah, because like we've optimized it, and they still find something to yeah. to to cry about. Because like, okay, just take or leave my perspective, because I'm not in temper tantrum. <laughs> I just kind of know how it works, just because of the nature of my relationship with you, Emory, and now too with Lauren. But like, you know, I kind of have some insider information. <laughs> um, also, I help run social media, so I kind of have to know what's going on. Uh, but like, and also like even with. Um, yeah, like just, you know, like stuff with like rehearsals and like you mentioned, like, you know, like you guys were bringing like the recovery stuff at rehearsals. I have never had like, you know, like I w- I hadn't performed since like high school, basically. Um, but like I have never had any rehearsal where anyone that's like in charge has brought anything to take care of us besides food. Oh, yeah. It was always just like here, eat so you don't die. I mean, also we were young, so we didn't really need recovery things, whatever. Yeah, we, oh, yeah, we were indestructible. We snacks to rehearsals and yeah. water and then... But even, yeah, yeah. even yeah. a lot of teams, like, it's like, hey, we're all meeting here. Bring your own water, bring your own yeah. shit. You hungry? Yeah. McDonald's, down the road. Yeah, that is, that is how it is. Yeah. It's yeah. changing. Yeah. And it's, I'm glad that it's changing. Yeah, and, and the people who have, ex, like, people who have experienced it, like, are thinking better yeah like, thinking like, more about what how to didn't improve. we like from our experiences before exactly how can we fix that here so exactly. none of them have to go through that oh my god yeah. it's like parenting <laughs> yeah like growing growing and moving forward yeah. and optimizing yeah 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 and i think i think temper tantrum has done a fantastic job at that oh yeah and i have never like you guys had that um i think the day emmer that you picked me up from the the day slash night that you picked me up at the airport oh. um back in may like you guys were like rehearsing for like nine hours for two things like if you did oh, God, rehearsal yeah, for you did rehearsal yeah. for the yummy video and then you did rehearsal for the friends and family night yes set. and i'm like it's and then emory was just sending me things and i'm like it's done <laughs> they rehearsed everything yeah, like, we got like what the we fuck? Got projects done in a month. Yeah, yeah. My um, one of my old uh, directors, she the other night we were talking. Uh, we had a we had an online Zoom crafts night. It was really I fun. saw that on your Instagram. Yeah, that was cute. And she well, because I left that for a little bit to do a meeting with board for temper tantrum and then i came back and then there i was just telling them like oh yeah we did a we had a meeting um uh, for this upcoming video that we're shooting that brandon like that brandon had an idea for and we just did a walkthrough we just looked we essentially looked at the the place virtually mm-hmm. and how like essentially x y and z and so we're just planning for it and my old director was like Prop to temper tantrum because you guys have been like turning out videos and projects like this. It's so the turnaround time is so fast. Yeah. Like, and it's it, it's really awesome to see you guys like doing all of that and like having it have having like all of this come out efficiently and in like a very like good amount of time. And I was like, and after being on both ends experiencing like the <laughs> like being in the board chat and then yeah. also like hearing this from one of per, someone who I very much look up to I've looked mm-hmm. up to for my entire dance career and like to hear that was very and then I I, I immediately like after I texted you and I told him like I, I told him like hey like um like she said this and it was it was nice to be for people who've actually been there yeah. and who've gone through the ringer for for years, mm-hmm. for fucking years, like to for to go from like the toxic dance community to running your own your own company, like and running 
a very like 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 doing a lot of shows and and uh, and a bunch of shit like that and having so much on your plate to have them say that we're doing good is like I was like fuck what everyone else says who 